Hi Pisces, welcome to my channel. This is a love romantic relationship reading for you. This is for the Pisces sign. This is the second week of May 2019. This is applicable for singles, couples in a relationship or dating. Please universe, what can I get for my Pisces friends for the second week of May 2019? What can I get for Pisces please? Second week of May 2019. Love romantic relationship or dating reading for Pisces sign. Okay, this flip out of the deck, so the first card is the Seven of Wands. You've got the Three of Wands. You've got the Knight of Pentacles. And you've got the Nine of Wands in reverse. For some of you, you regret that you are fighting. For some of you, you regret that you argued. For some of you, you, you regret something about a fight, something about a misunderstanding. For some of you, because of this fight, this misunderstanding, this argument, it has, um, it has made this person change his mind to travel and see you. Something to do with planning. Queen of Wands. So for some of you, yep, you know, it's it's you're regretting, you're sad, you're lonely because of an argument, all right? For some of you, I'm picking up, they regret they argued with you, they regret they communicated this with you. There's something about fighting over something that someone is regretful. Someone is missing someone, but they couldn't communicate because there's still an argument and it has something to do with planning or it could be for some of you, I'm picking up like the cha the, the plan. There's been a change of plan and you're sad about that plan and you're arguing to make that plan happen or you're questioning that plan. You're arguing, someone is ar in argument that they mood, all right? F could also a card of standing your ground because you're fighting off to make the plan, you know, to reach the plan, to get into a place to travel, to execute the plan for some of you. For some of you, you regret about or sad about this plan not make, not you know not really not happening. For some of you, it is a more collective energy is really sad because you guys are arguing. You know, for some of you, I'm picking like, you know, you you're you're missing someone is missing someone and they can't really communicate right now because you're still in an argument. You're still in um, a no talking or if you talk you kind of argue so someone is missing someone someone is regretful about something of an argument for some of you I'm picking up like because someone de demand pursue um, provoke um, um, is persistent about making things happen that is not really unplanned you argued and someone regret someone is lonely Someone, as a result of that argument, is sad, regretful, and unable to move on. You know, unable to, for some of you, unable to forgive themselves because they, they, you know, they made it complicated. Um, so there's sadness about an argument. Someone is missing someone and unable to contact right now because you're still in argument. You're still not communicating. You're still fighting for some of you. But the good news, the, the sorry, the good news is you've got the, you know, the Knight of Pentacles. For some of you who've been waiting for a person to come back, where you had a fight, you had a misunderstanding, where you had to put a, a boundary, a deadline, they're gonna come back. All right, the Knight of Pentacles. This is an offer. This is a night where you are waiting for this night to come along, and it is happening for that offer. For some of you, it's going to be a surprise come back because Nine of Wands, this is caught off guard. For some of you, this is just an energy of um, embracing, you know. For some of you, if you fight, if you had an argument and um, it, it's been two, three weeks, two months, you know, it's been, it's been quite a long time since you talk, since the last time you talk. When this person, when a situation, an opportunity comes to you to connect, to reconnect again, you won't you wouldn't even brought up the topic of the the argument you would just embrace them and you know catch up with them with you know whatever stuff you missed to talk about with this person like you wouldn't even go and you know uh 
touch the subject. You you just talk. You just re you, you just talk. You just catch up on the things that you need to catch up. You won't even for some of you um discuss the argument, the subject, the topic of the argument. You would just be cough you know, off, you know, caught off guard and just be open to just and embrace this person, whoever it is, or this communication. For some of you, this is the reason why it's you're sad. You know, you're sad because you haven't communicated. You haven't said sorry. You haven't communicated with them. You haven't said sorry. It's been blank. For some of you, I'm picking up like it's been blank for two, three weeks, a month, so on and so forth. It depends on your situation. But I felt like you know, it's gonna pick up again the second, third. This is the theme of your month, May month for some of you. Those who had an argument that, you know, that an argument really like a huge fight, huge argument. I felt like, you know, there is an opportunity in the next two to three weeks for you guys, for this person to come along with an, you know, with an offer, to opportunity to talk. From that talk, from that conversation, it's gonna bring along um, an energy of openness, embracing how you miss this person, um, you know, caught you off guard. For some of you, you're, you know, for some of you, you're not, for some of you, I'm picking up, you know, because you haven't talked for so long. All you have within you is like anger, hurt, pain, blah, 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 blah. But as soon as you see this person, as soon as they send you a message, it is as if, you know, the, the, the you know, the anger, the hurt, the pain, it, it just melted. And because you missed him so much, you, you just went on and embraced and talked like, you know, it never happened. Like the argument didn't happen. Yeah, so that's what I'm picking up. And, you know, the, the clarifying card is the Queen of Swords, you know. It, it's alive, you know. It's, it's, it's still there. The flame, the flare, the flirting, the, the stuff within you and this person that you share, it is alive, you know. For some of you, you thought like because of this argument, it was dead. There's no communication. It was blank. But as soon as you hit up, as soon as that comes, as soon as you connect, you won't even go back to that subject matter of the argument. You will just, you know, um, you'll just embrace embrace each other and just talk. For some of you, I'm I'm really sensing like a night a night of long talk of catching up. Because you miss each other. Sometimes this is a, this is a reading where the more you hate, the more you love. <laughs> and so as soon as you connect, reconnect. Like I'm really picking up like um, you haven't talked to each other. And all you say or all the comments and all the thoughts you have for this person is that I am so annoyed. Or I hate this person. I don't like this person. But as soon as they come along all those <laughs> all this pain all this hurt it's like glitters it just come out and melt and you are just drawn to the connection you know it's like openness to embrace and for getting out for getting out for forgetting the you know this stuff this argument and you know and the the the, the flame the the passion the connection is is back so it's really good it's 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 for some of you i'm picking up like be ready, you know, be ready because after a long fight, this is, you know, indeed, sorry, I'm just moving the camera. You know, after a long fight, this is a undeniable reconnection. Like you can't really resist, you know, this, I'm, I'm seeing a connection, a reconnection where, you know, you keep saying like negative things. Like you, you keep saying, I will not talk to her. I will not forgive her. I will. I'm so annoyed. I'm blah, blah, blah. But the minute they're back, you just swallowed whatever you said and just embraced them with two hands and, you know. So it's, it, be careful. Be careful what of, <laughs> be careful of the things you, you say out because you might, you might take that back again because as soon as you see the presence of this person, the message of this person, all the hate, it, it, it's just gonna melt and it will be, <laughs> replaced by glitters of sparkling connection a reconnection and attraction so this is for you um this is for your second week um what can i ask can i ask more can you give me a message for um um pisces dating dating pisces getting to know each other you've got ten of swords yeah confusion is over Queen of Cups, and this person is ready to 
offer a more stable connection. All right. For those who are um, reconnecting, those are reconnecting or um, married couples or couples that went through a breakup. All right. Just give me a second. What's the message for marriage couple or in a relationship that went through a breakup, please? Four of Swords in reverse. The world is in reverse. One more, please. Three of Swords. So, the third part, for those who has third party, it's saying it's over. The third party is over. But the issue... The struggle, the healing, the um, the pain that you brought to each other, it's it's not done. All right, you're still, you still have to at least process three to four months or more on so, um, for you guys to um, to get back or to resolve. Because I felt like it's the world is in reverse. This is unfinished business, and it's facing the four of swords. So. I don't think that this is a permanent separation or breakup, all right? What I see in here is that the third party, the pain, the hurt, it's going away. It's diminishing. It's disappearing. Um, but you guys need to heal. You guys need to forgive. You guys need to um, individually have, like, you need to have space for each other. Because as soon as you connect, reconnect, you know, you always clash. So there's a need for you guys to have a space, think about it, heal, and just give some breathe because there's been a clash, you know, for breakup, for breakup couple or in a relationship. I don't think it's over yet. Uh, the world is in reverse right now. It's really saying it's really saying that you know it's uh, it's 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 not the lucky time for you. All right. Something needs to heal. But the good thing about it is that the Three of Swords is in reverse. So you're getting out of that hatred to each other. Like, you don't want to, like, you know, before you want to kill each other. But right now, you're moving along with that hatred, pain, or third party is over. It's more of healing individually. Giving a space um, to each other. Because the world, it's in reverse. So it means that there's still, you know, the way, the way you guys, um... The way you guys move, it's reversed. There's something that you need to go back, all right? The, to go back, you will still encounter or face off with the Four of Swords in reverse, which is stressful, unable to sleep. But it's fine, you know, you'll go through that. The world is circle, it's round. You go down, but you will go up again. It's a wheel, all right? So this is for marriage or in a relationship that went through a breakup. For those who are dating, the guy, the person that you're dealing with, they're coming out of pain or you guys are coming out of confusion. And sooner or later, after this confusion or, you know, this whatever, it could be you're dating someone that has a dark past, her hurt, you know, they're more ready. They're more ready to serve you with emotions and attentions, okay? And then for the general collective reading, so this opportunity, wait for this to come up two to three weeks from now and um you know be ready because you might just you know for some of you i'm really picking up let your guard down because they're coming back you might just forget everything the argument and just embrace whoever it is because this is how you miss them and how you regret the the fight all right, so this is for you, Pisces. Thanks for your time. Thanks for being here. It's been a pleasure doing this reading for you. If you do like the reading, please don't forget to click like. If you want to join my team, please click subscribe. And thank you very much for my awesome supporter, for my follower. Thank you, and I'll see you soon again. Bye-bye.